hey everyone welcome back to my channel yes another video <laughs> um let me go ahead and start off this video by saying thank you to everybody that watched my video thank you for all the positive comments um i'm actually thinking about making this a consistent thing i was thinking about making it like maybe a tuesday and thursday or a tuesday and friday let me know in the comments below what you guys think also let me know what you would like to see from me whether you want to see another purse collection video or whether you want to see another sunglass collection video or you want to see a makeup tutorial let me know in the comments um, as well make sure that you're liking you're sharing you're subscribing and make sure that you click on the notification bell so that anytime that you anytime that I post a video you are well aware that the video is available for you guys um, so let me go ahead and start off with what this video is all about. So some of these are actually some of my purse collection <laughs> and I would like to give a shout out to Crazy Sexy Tomboy. They are uh, sponsoring the video but also want to make sure that you guys are aware that not all of these items I'm going to showcase were provided by Crazy Sexy Tomboy. Um, some of the some of the items I actually purchased myself. Whenever I see a brand that is up and coming, and I believe in your brand, I will spend money with you. And because I see that I saw that there were items on there that I really really liked and I really really wanted, I went ahead and wanted to purchase some of the items. Um, and let me tell you, you guys are not going to be disappointed. So I, but just like my sunglass collection, I'm going to leave the best for last. So this one I'm going to start off with and as well air all the information regarding the items that will be showcased will be provided in the description box below. Make sure that you are looking at the description box because my um, discount code will also be provided. So if you decide that you see something that you want to purchase for yourself, make sure that you use that discount code. If you don't want to use it, that's fine. That's fine. You can still go on the site, see what you like, browse, do whatever. But hey, I am going to start off with this purse right here. Um, you know, the Velvet Trend is so in right now. So I wanted, I kind of jumped on the bag in and I wanted to get this little miniature purse. I have worn this twice and I love it. Even though it's small, this thing can, can fit a lot of things. If, let, me, let me tell you. Um, I was able to fit my purse in here. Um, person <laughs> I was able to fit my um, cell phone in here um, my hairbrush what else was I able to put in here I was able to put some stuff in here let me tell you this thing can hold some stuff um, look at it it's so nice it's so velvety don't look at my nails I'm gonna get them done but it's so nice and so velvety and it just feels so rich oh, God, it feels so rich and whenever you buy items always think about the longevity of the item not just think about the the trend because yeah trends come but then you also have to remember that trends go as well so whenever you purchase things make sure that you're thinking about the longevity how long is this item going to last you and anytime that I purchase something that is the first thing that comes to mind how long do I want this item to last me because let me tell you there are some things in my closet right now that I've had since I was in high school and I'm still using yeah Okay, so then you can see that this thing has a clasp to close, and it's a flap closure. Um, I like to keep the little fillings inside to keep the shape of my purses. That's more my preference. You can do whatever. Some, um, all the purses that come from Crazy Sexy Tomboy will all come with fillings inside. Uh, you can either choose to keep them inside to keep the, the shape of the purse, or you can just take it out. It's up to you. And you can see how deep this thing is. Look at how deep it is. That's how. That's why I tell you when I put my my um, my uh, cell phone in here and my hairbrush and everything. This thing was filling it up, like for real. It was holding everything. And then you can see that it also has a little um, flap in here where you can put your credit card, your money, whatever in here. I sometimes I put my business cards in here as well. And look at the hardware. Look at the hardware, and it's so easy to close back up. So easy. This hardware is so nice and rich looking, 
Because you know sometimes when you purchase things, the hardware doesn't always last. It's either looking like it's about to rust or it just falls apart. But this, let me, like I said, I've been wearing this, I've worn this three times and I've not been disappointed. You can either wear this as a crossbody. I personally do not like wearing things like crossbody. I just, I don't like feeling closed in. So I wear it more like this. Let me show you how I wear it. Let me show you how I wear it. I wear it more like, I fold it up in two inside the clasp, the flap, clasp, whatever you want to call it. I fold it in two and then make it a little bit smaller. See? This is how I like to wear it. I don't like the... Um, or you can make it, you can still make it long like that if you want to. You can still make it long like that. But yeah, I love this purse. So let me go ahead. I cannot remember the name of it, but like I said, I will be providing the description and the description, the information in the description box below and how much it was as well. I'll also provide that in the description box below. So let's go on to the next one this one i definitely know what name it is this is actually the, a chanel inspired purse when i saw this i had to have it this is actually one that i purchased myself i mean look at it the the chevron patent and it's so nice it's more like a jelly it feels like the the boy bag it's so it it has that jelly feeling but it, it don't it doesn't look cheap it looks so nice and look at the gold hardware this i've worn so many times and every time i wear this purse like i get so many compliments and people ask me where i bought it, where i got it from so i always tell them exactly where i got it from um but look even though it's really small like the other miniature um purse that i showed you guys this also can carry a lot of things inside of it and it has it's a gold tone same thing clasp you can open it up and also, like I said, I like to keep the fillings inside of it. Let me, let me show you guys. Oop, got a lot of crap in here. That's how often I wear this purse. It has two things inside. Like it has two spacers inside of it. So you can use both spacers. It doesn't have a zipper inside of it, but it's okay. It still fill, fills a lot of your stuff. Okay, come out. And look at the hardware. The hardware is so nice. It's so nice. Hardware is so nice. Look at it. It's so, it looks so expensive. It looks so rich. Like, you will die to have this purse. It is so nice. So nice. And this description as well will also be provided in the description box below as well. So when I saw this purse, I had to get it. And it's so funny because I was in the, in the process of purchasing this item, but I got this in the mail from Crazy Sexy Tomboy. I don't know, maybe they were reading my mind or whatever, but I, like, it came... In the mail and i was so happy because every time i tried to purchase this purse it was always getting sold out it's like damn but this is the um gucci inspired purse like look at it like okay look, look, just just look just just look at it look at it <laughs> just look at it it is so nice like i don't have any color like this in my in my boudoir I don't have this in my boudoir, so I wanted to go ahead and have one of this in in my collection. It's um, burgundy um, wine red on their website. I think they call it wine red. But this, I had to have it. I have a lot of reds, but I don't have any color like this. And look at the hardware. Because you know, like I said before, when you have like replicas or dupes or anything like that, the hardware always feels like it's about to tarnish or um, rust, but this has not disappointed. Like, look at it. It just looks so nice. It looks so nice. And let me show you the inside as well. Okay, so the inside, look at how 
much you can fit in this damn thing. This thing is so big, you can fit your whole house inside of it. I'm just exaggerating. But yeah, you can fit a lot of stuff in here. So you here, I like to put a lot of my business cards in here. I like to put my, what else do I like to put? My money and my credit card in here. Um, this has also fit my uh, tablet, my cell phone, my hairbrush, and whatever else it can fit in here. And look at the heart, and look, this is how it closes. The closure is like right there. And here's another flap in here too. I've never used it, but if you wanted to hide, make sure that none of your credit cards get stolen or anything like that, you can also put it in here. It's so convenient. Um, it is kind of difficult to try to get things out, but again, I don't use it. You yourself may not use it if you purchase this item or purchase this purse, but yeah. I mostly use these ones right here and it's so easy to close too okay and look at the hardware this is so nice you can, again you can wear it it's long you can wear it as a for um, as a crossbody or you can shorten it up and then just wear it like this I like wearing it like this but it depends on your preference you may want to make it shorter and then just wear it like this but yeah, I love this purse. This is, um, I think they have, how many versions do they have? How many colors do they have? I think they have four colors. This color, the black, which I'm about to show you, um, tan and in silver. I, I was actually thinking about getting the tan, but I don't know if it's overkill. Let me know if it's overkill. Okay, this is the one I actually reach for the most. I mostly reach for the black one. Like, look at it. You could wear it with anything. Same hardware. Um, it is so... It, and then both of them are made of suede. Yeah, both of them are made of suede. It is so nice and so rich. It's so... You, this goes with everything. You may see a little bit stained because you can tell that I've been wearing this a lot more than the other one. But this is my this is one of my favorite that I mostly grab for. Um, you may also see it in a lot of my. I think you saw it in one of my pictures on Instagram. If you follow me on Instagram, make sure you're following me on Instagram. Make sure you're following me on Instagram. I'll link the I'll leave the links below. But yeah, you will see this on Instagram. I took a picture of it, and it's there. So you can see how it looks like in person. Well, you can see it here, but you know what I mean. Okay. And here is another one. When I saw this, I don't have anything pink in my collection. I'm not really girly girly. Um, long story short, <laughs> it took high waters, okay, for my mother to put a dress on me. I hated dresses. I still hate dresses. But as you grow older, or as I grew older, I kind of wanted to be a little bit girly. So I do wear dresses, but back then, oh my god, it, it, it was trouble to put dress on me. Because as soon as I get to school, jeans were going, and that dress was coming off and I was wearing jeans. <laughs> Sorry, Mom, if you're watching this video. <laughs> but yeah, this is the faux leather. Like, can you see? See the detail of this this is so pretty this is so pretty look at this look when I like they have it in white and black in this version on their website um, they also have it in the miniature sizes too I did not want to get the miniature sizes I wanted this size but if you want to you can also get it in the miniature size but again it say has the same hardware has the same like look at the handles I'm not gonna open up because it's like it's basically the same thing it looks like the same thing but with the other ones but this is in full leather with um, I don't know if you guys can see that but like a full snake skin design um, and I think on their website it's called dragon head purse but again I, I'll leave all that information below So, so, 
when I saw this purse, I had to get it. Um, at first, when I was looking at their site, they weren't actually launching the purse yet. They sent out um, a newsletter. Make sure that you go on their websites and sign up on their newsletter so that you can always get on the, um, the VIP and know what they're coming out with. Because that is how I saw this purse. Because when I saw this purse, I was like, I want that purse. I need that purse. And I'm going to get it. It was so I contact because it wasn't yet on their site. It was going to be a new arrival. So I contacted them and asked them, okay, when would this be on the site? I would like to know uh, so I, I can go ahead and purchase. So they said, yeah, give us your information and we will let you know as soon as possible. So, of course, like I said, life got in the way, so I completely forgot that I sent them an email. Next thing I know, I go in my mailbox and I find this person in my mailbox and I was so. Okay, I almost did back flip, front flip, side flip. Ah, this purse, man. This is what I got. This is what I can you can you see? Can you see this? This is so pretty. <laughs> I don't know why I'm singing, but this is so nice. This is so um I can't remember the name of the ins uh, the inspiration, but this is so nice. And they have it in three different colors. They have it in black, red, and green, I believe. Um, I have the red version, which I am about to show you, but I wanted you guys to see this. This is so, this is the faux leather snakeskin pattern. Okay. This is what they have so, in there. Look at the hardware. It is so rich. Um, it's gold tone. You will not, you definitely will not regret having this in your collection this has taken me through so many nice places so many i've worn it up i've worn it down i've worn this with i've there was a point there was a time where i looked so freaking raggedy i had like baggy pants um what else was i wearing i i, I was just looking a hot mess but i look cute though and I put this purse with it. Oh my God! It just put that whole outfit together. Okay, together. You just have to have one item to just bring an just to bring an outfit together, and you be okay. Um, so this is really nice. And then it's like the other purses, you can wear it crossbody, or you can wear it shorter. It depends on how you feel. Do you? And here, last but not least. The pièce de résistance. Can you see this? Okay. If nobody, anybody that knows me knows that red is my favorite color. Red is my all-time favorite color. So when I saw this on their site, I had to get it. And as well, I was going to purchase this myself. And I believe I had this posted where... I said, okay, I'm gonna buy. It. I'm gonna get this purse, and I happened. They sent this to me for my birthday present. Thank you, crazy sexy tomboy. But yeah, I love this purse. This is my favorite all-time purse. I wear this everywhere. Okay, wear this everywhere. This purse is like an eye catcher. Everywhere I go, get stopped. People ask me. Like tell well not we they don't ask me but they tell me how they like the purse they love it and I do like I don't know thank you but <laughs> but yeah this is my favorite purse um back is so nice look at it it's just the faux leather snakeskin um pattern on it same thing same hardware right there really nice really rich looking and like my other purses so i like to keep the little filling inside it's, it's the same thing like the black one same hardware as well same hardware you can also wear it as a crossbody you know i'm not taking this out you guys already seen that on the black one but you can wear it as a crossbody you can wear it um short as well or you can just keep the handles inside and just wear it as a clutch and that's sometimes what I do as well. If I don't want to be bothered with the handles, I just keep the handles inside and then just wear it like a clutch. Um, so that is it. 
yeah, that is it. Thank you so much, you guys, for being in my video and watching my video. Sorry, I'm just being retarded. Um, yeah, thank you so much, you guys, for sticking with me and watching this video. Let me know what else you'd like to see. Make sure that you're liking. Make sure you're subscribing. Make sure that you're commenting. Leave your positive comments. Leave your negative negative comments. Leave your comments. I mean, your negative comments will also help me grow. Um, so whatever, because, I mean, positive criticism, negative criticism, still criticism. I'm 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 open to everything. I'm I don't I don't discriminate. Let me know what I'm doing wrong and I'll go from there. That's how you learn, that's how you grow. If you if you don't grow, then you stay stagnant, you stay satisfied. We don't that's not what we're trying to do here. That's not what we're trying to do. Okay? That is not what we're trying to do. <laughs> so again, thank you guys for sticking with me. Let me know again what you would like to see in my next video. And, um, let me know if you would like for me to when you would like for me to see to make more videos I, like I said I, I was thinking about making videos on Tuesdays and Thursdays or Tuesdays and Fridays let me know which one sometimes again uh, or I may just have make it a Tuesday or make it a Friday let me know give me suggestions let's let's have a discussion together um, make sure that you follow me on my Instagram um, Facebook and as well my snapchat you will find me more on Instagram. If you like to see my pretty face, just follow me. If you're hearing a noise in the background, that's my dog eating. So, Rock, say hi. He just gave me a side look. Never mind. But, <laughs> but, hey, um, what was I about to say? Go with God. Stay safe. And. Deuce.